Well, I think people who really love this football club um, wouldn't, wouldn't do something like this. Um, so for, for people to continue um, in the way they are, I feel as though they don't really love this football club and we have to question uh, why they come into the stadium. It's, uh, it's unacceptable. Um, and, you know, as we've seen in Melbourne, um, it's, the game was stopped because of, because of the, the interruption from the smoke. Um, and it's not, it's not something that, that we need in our game. Um, it's definitely um, a disruption. Um, and, you know, as players, we, we want to see that uh, cleared out of the game. I think it's uh, more disappointing um, in the fact that the, the FFA looking to take points off us. Um, you know, we, we don't like the game when it's brought into disrepute. Um, and we hope that this, uh, this situation is dealt with um, as soon as possible and, and that the players aren't punished for something that uh, is totally out of our control. It's, it's hard to say. From, I haven't really seen too much about it in the media and that, but I've heard that uh, it's hard for the club, you know, because some of them are non-members. So it, it's a difficult situation, but we know that rules are rules at the end of the day. We don't condone flares in the, in the A-League at, at any game, and I think the biggest priority is people's safety. So we understand what it is, and, you know, it's only, you know, not just our fans, but I think across the league, 99.95% are doing the right thing. Everyone looks forward to the weekend, the players, the fans, the media, everyone that comes on the match day. So I think the biggest priority is, is safety and making sure that everyone has a, a safe experience and a fun experience. And I think a large, large amount are doing that. And it's a bit unfortunate that a small minority are now, it's painting everyone with that different brush and you know giving an image of that, which is, I think, a bit unfortunate and unjust. Uh, it's, it's hard to say, you know, it's always going to be pumped up in the media and, and throughout where it's, it gets turned. But like I was saying before that, it's a 99.95% that are doing the right thing and maybe a very small minority. And so it, it's, it's hard, I guess. And, um, you know, it's something that we want to eradicate from the game and take that away. That's it. You know, every, every person that comes to a match, whether it be a player, you know, you, you can only control yourself on that day. And, and um, you know, we, we love our fans. They've been fantastic. And, um, but at the same token, we, you know, that pl the people's safety when they come to a game, that's the most important thing. And, and we, I think it'd be unfortunate if anything ever did happen. So I totally agree and understand with the, the rules and they have been set in place for a reason. And, you know, we have to abide by those rules.